Allah for the moon and the stars. Praise Him all day for what is and what was. Take hold of your Ya sa muna daga cikin waɗannan zaɓaɓɓun bayin nasa 
ya kuma saka mana da gida aljanna ya kuma ni santar da mu daga munanan halaye wassalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh ya kuma rahmatullahi wabarakatuh sunan sai isa isu daga makaranta tarbiya community college ta babban secondary babban secondary ta bangaren islamiya ta yamma sura to no zamu sura ta 24 daga aya ta 1 zuwa ta 10 
was granted to Almighty Allah, the beneficial, the merciful, who spared our life to witness this historic occasion of our speech and pride given day. Today, Saturday, 8th of Al Muharram, 1444, which is equivalent to the 6th of August 2022. The history of al Tarbiya Community College will not be comprehensive without mentioning the names of the, main, uh, the names and great contribution of some eminent personalities like late Dr. Habibu Muhammad Barzo, Al Hadi Musa Abdullahi Megatari. Al Haji Mukhtar Umar, Dr. Abdullahi Muhammad Gezo, the President School's Coordinator. Al Haji Bachar Tambata, Al Haji Mahmoud Ayuba Suleiman, Al Haji Kabir uh, Umar, and Al Haji Abakar Sadiq, former chairman of the Madrasa Islam in Bordoro. Uh, as well as many others whose names cannot be mentioned. Here, who as members of Al Madaris Islam Hodoro contributed greatly to the establishment and growing of the school. Alhamdulillah. May Allah reward them abundantly. Amen. Uh, a Tarbiya group of schools was established about three decades ago. But secondary section came into existence in October 2007 with only 14 students. Only 14 students. Now we are talking about 500 students. So, and about three teaching staff. About three teaching staff. Myself as the principal and Staff then, namely, Madam Abu Bakar Omar Salu, presently the vice principal admin of the school, and another teacher called Madam Hashim Abdullah, were the first teachers of the school. We were three in number at that time in 2007. Maybe some DS student were maybe not born at that time, but they were kids at that time. Alhamdulillah. So, subsequently, other staff who join us include uh, Madam Khadija. Uh, we call her Mama Omaima. She was the first female teacher in the school. She was the first female teacher who taught in the school. Then, Madam Muhammad Abdullahi Baba, currently school admin secretary, totally known as Madam Dallani. Then he joined us as a teacher at that time. Then, Madam Abu Bakar Hussein, Madam uh, al who taught PhD at that time. So, we were the uh, pioneer teachers at that time. Uh, the earlier task, the earlier task and challenge uh, of the teaching staff at that time was to ensure effective teaching and learning in the school and make all effort uh, to change the notion of the people. The notion of the people, the, which means the belief at that time people have that Tahfi school like ours, I mean Tahfi school like a Terbia cannot teach conventional courses effectively like math, English and other sciences. It cannot be taught in that school at that time. That was the notion of the people in those days. So that is why it was a challenge to us at that time that we have to change this notion at that time. So, but 
Sanochen was from Rome. As the school group is qualitative standard academically, when it excels in a number of competitions in different academic fields and programs at zonal director level and at state level. We are always grateful to Allah for the achievements recorded. Alhamdulillah. It took the school at least a decade to attain its current status. The status of the school raised from junior secondary school to senior secondary school that can offer all courses that are supposed to be offered in any accomplished secondary school. Example, art, commercial and science classes. We have them now all. The school produced competent students who excel in not only SSE exam or SSE performance, but in JAM, plus UTME, as well as university and other tertiary institutions, internal examinations. We used to hear from our uh, former students that they are now performing excellently in their institutions either university or colleges of education, wherever they find themselves, they are performing very well, which means that they had a good foundation or background uh, of their studies. Uh, the school is proud of such competent students currently studying at different universities or graduated from many universities within and outside the country. Alhamdulillah. All these academic achievements could not be achieved without the services of competent and disciplined teaching staff. As it is obvious that one cannot get what he doesn't have. If you don't have something, you cannot give it. To that effect, the school is really proud of its competent teaching staff who had work and ensured this academic achievement. Uh, in my address, I will never forget the great contribution of some concerned parents who feel that they cannot be the school for the significant services of them and their children. It is our hope that all parents in the school should emulate positive attitude of this category of parents who support the school in its activities and disciplinary measures taken to ensure proper behavior training of their children. To this effect, let me remind this important gathering about the mission of the school. It's very important to remind you about it. Uh, school mission and mission. I will read it now. Uh, in Atarbia, we focus on inspiring learners with fear of Allah and proper teachings of Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, as well as producing disciplined uh, learners with academic excellence in various fields uh, of knowledge, which comprise Quranic studies, English, Arabic, computer, science, and art subjects. This is the mission of a Tarbiya community parent. You should acquire knowledge in this mention disciplines. And at the same time, you must be disciplined. Because as I have been saying it right, if you acquire knowledge without discipline, it's worthless. It's worthless. You will not be uh, some of the functional members uh, of the society because you lack discipline. And even your knowledge will not benefit you and the society in general. At last, I would like uh, to respect our gratitude to Almighty Allah who facilitated all the school achievement through the happy leadership of Dr. Abdullah Muhammad Diego, the, uh, the coordinator of the school, who also enjoy the great support from al Madaris al Islami Uturu, currently headed by Aladi Mahmoud Ayyub Suleiman, 
the school government council headed by Araja Kabir Musa Mekateri, the PTA of the school headed by Araja Ayatullah Salum, and the board of trustees of al Madarisul Islami headed by Araja Bachari Dambata. So, Dr. Abdullah Imamah gives the pains of the coordinator of the school. He gets the support of these personalities at their capacities, heading some of the agencies that uh, regulate the activities of the schools established by al Madarisul Islami Kotoru. So, may Allah reward them abundantly. Amen. My appreciation also goes to all school section and heads. We have about 11 sections in the school. Secondary school is just one of these 11 sections. So I am grateful to all the sectional heads for their contribution to the success of secondary school itself. Uh, the consultant, my appreciation also goes to the consultant of the school in person of Manam Zakaria Abdullahi Bapa as well as head teacher of primary school manners who is have been strong members of the main committee of this speech and prize given day. Uh, I also appreciate the effort of all our teaching and non-teaching staff, especially teachers who want to get the membership or the subcommittees of the main committee of speech and prize given day, which ensured its success which ensure its success. To all of you who are present, I have to say, Jadakumullah khairan for the sin. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuhu. Wa alaikum wa
Nigeria subdivided into six different political zones. These are Northwest, North East, North Central, Southwest, South East, and South South. What well, is the information about Nigeria? How you get it there? Then the Kano said, Kano was the capital of an emirate in 19th century before being captured by the British in 1943. More than Kano is from Asia and Indochina Center. The current metropolitan population is 4 million point something. They are both for local government. Kano said, We can prove Nasarawa had a lot of power amongst others. My dear audience, I hope you understand what I speak now. Thank you so much. Thank you, Mustafa, for the very description. Now we have come to the end of this action. I want my respective students to understand where the explanation is by Mustafa. Long live Africa, long live Nigeria, long live Palestine, long live Atabia Community College, long live my fellow students. Thank you all. Thank you once again.
azo ai rawa kula ni ai ta hau sawa ai te ikala wana idan ka je cikin kauyen da yake kowa ne kauye ka koya wa yaro rawa zai zo ya maka ita anan amma wannan abun wallahi sai an je makaranta makaranta kuma mai ta gaske ba ne gurin gurin ba dukkan dan malaman da suka koya wa idan malamai ne masu addini da tarbiya a cikin su alhamdulillah ini <tuh> wa faragika qabla shughli wa shababika qabla harami wa ginaka qabla faqri wal hadith wal hadith sahih kama fi sahih al-jani wal albani bil albani rahimullah the prophet peace and blessings of allah be to him say make the most of five things before five others three times before becoming baby Life before death, health before sickness, youth before all the health, and youth, be youth before all the health, and wealth for for body. Salamu alaikum. Wa alaikum. Wa salamu alaikum. Wa salamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Ismi Ammar Isa Yusuf Mesut Bissani Al-Ilani Kuliyatu Tarbiya Al-Mujtama'iyya. عن ابن عباس قال قال رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم نعمتان مغبون فيهما قصير من النار الصحة والفراغ ابن عباس نعرض جدك مسجد الله صلى الله عليه وسلم said Teach brothers that many of the people's conduct are tells and read and transmitted by Tirmidhi السلام عليكم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله اسمي اسم حيا طيب محمد من فصل الأول عن إنجاتي بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قال مسلم حدثني جهير بن هرب حدثني جهير عن سهيل عن أبي هريرة رضي الله عنه قال قال رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم سفان من أهل النار لم أرونا أو نراه سياح كأجناب البقر يدفعون بها الناس ونساء كسياح الآريات مؤمنات مائلات لا يقدرن الجنة ولا يجدن ريحا ريحا يوجد كثيرة كلا وقفا هي الترانسليشن أبو هريرة قال الله سبحانه وتعالى بيبي بأقول هاو سيد تو أي تيم أوف جينيزيم أبيل من أي بتوسي And I want to meet some people. I know men who will be dressed but apart from them. Who will be inclined to be a woman to a star? Be inclined to what it? They need to be inclined to why inclined to what it? They will not end up by death and they will not spread it all. Where is it all? They will be spread for a short distance. For some while. Communities. So, if you say that 
development is by it is due to readiness of the community which led to that. It is also believed that the community members play a part role in aggregating all these insecurity problems due to this undefeated point. Our community lacks cooperation to the extent that poor abuse rich people for neglecting them. Vulnerable, orphans, widows, disabled, school jobs out, and many other less privileged ones are not considered by the community members. But government does everything possible to eliminate and eradicate poverty by many employment and employment for the poor to be stably right. Another strong issue I have is that government works tirelessly to employ security personnel, motors, weapons, constant watching, retired security officers for them to train the younger officers. But in the community we live, we all know that there are categories of people who sell intoxicants to the youth. Where is the community? Are they not from the community?
weaknesses. I know your answer is government weaknesses. Mr. Chairman, sir, I don't like judges. I cannot thank you, sir. Not because of the result, but due to time factor. I will end up my speech by reminding you, my co-director, that government is responsible for the insecurity in Nigeria, not the community. Thank you for your statement.
Allah for the moon and the stars. Praise Him all day for what is and what was. Take hold of your iman. Don't give in to shaitan. Oh, you who believe, please give thanks to Allah.